Welcome to Cute E-Learning Channel. In this lecture, we will discuss the metal dusting. Description of damage. High temperature corrosion, metal dusting, results in accelerated localized pitting that occurs in process streams containing carbon and oxygen. Pits form on the surface and may contain carbon soot and metal dust particles. Affected materials Low alloy steels, 300 series stainless steel, nickel based alloys, and heat resisting alloys. There is currently no known metal alloy that is immune to metal dusting under all conditions. Critical factors Process stream composition, operating temperature, and alloy composition are critical factors. Metal dusting is preceded by carburization and is characterized by rapid metal wastage. It usually occurs in the approximate operating temperature range of 900 degrees Fahrenheit to 1500 degrees Fahrenheit. Metal dusting preferentially attacks the grain boundaries resulting in the removal of metal grains that form what appears to be a metal dust. In high nickel alloys, it is thought that metal dusting occurs without the formation of metal carbides. Affected units or equipment. Metal dusting has been reported in gas turbines methanol reforming unit outlet piping, thermal hydrodealkylation furnaces, and reactors, outlets of steam reformer heaters, and partial oxidation units. Appearance or morphology of damage. As illustrated in figures, in low alloy steels, the wastage is typically severe and can be uniform but usually is in the form of small pits, filled with a crumbly residue of metal particles and carbon soot. There may be areas of numerous rounded pits, uniform thinning, and or through wall perforations. In stainless and high alloy steels, the attack is frequently local, appearing as deep, round pits. Metallography will show that the metal is carburized under the attacked surface. Prevention, mitigation. For protection, a low level of a reactive sulfur species, typically less than 10 parts per million, such as hydrogen sulfide or a disulfide, must always be in the process environment to prevent the absorption of carbon on the surface of the metal. Control of the process stream composition to ensure the carbon activity is maintained below one can effectively prevent metal dusting. In a steam reformer heater that is forming a syn gas, metal dusting can be prevented by maintaining the steam to carbon ratio of the feed above 2 to 3. In many cases, equipment is refractory lined to keep metal temperatures below the range where metal dusting occurs. An aluminum diffusion treatment, such as alanizing applied to the base metal, can be beneficial in some applications. Inspection and monitoring. Metal dusting is most accurately confirmed through destructive testing that is sampling for chemical or physical evidence. RT techniques can be employed to look for pitting, cracking, and wall thinning. A specialized methodology combining intelligent pigging technology with an advanced engineering assessment 
If internal surfaces are accessible, visual inspection is effective. Related mechanisms Carburization Summary Description High temperature corrosion metal dusting results in accelerated localized pitting that occurs in process streams containing carbon and oxygen. Pits form on the surface and may contain carbon soot and metal dust particles. Temperature range it usually occurs in the operating temperature range of 900 degrees Fahrenheit to 1500 degrees Fahrenheit. Affected metallurgy Low alloy steels, 300 series stainless steel, nickel-based alloys, and heat-resisting alloys. Prevention For protection, a low level of a reactive sulfur species less than 10 ppm must always be in the process environment and aluminum diffusion treatment such as alanizing applied to the base metal in many cases equipment is refractory lined inspection methods destructive testing vt if internal surfaces are accessible rt techniques a specialized methodology combining intelligent pigging technology with an advanced engineering assessment. Review questions Question number one Carburization and metal dusting are Answer is A Question number two. Metal dusting usually occurs in the operating temperature range of 1.5 Answer is B. Question number three. In stainless and high alloy steels, the metal dusting is frequently looks like Answer is B. This lecture is prepared by Samir Saad, and this is his profile. Thanks a lot for watching, and please waiting us for next lecture.